Welcome back to the water bottle capital of the world, CampingGearTV.com. I'm Josh. I'm Ben. As always, our good friend Gary has joined us for another special episode, and today we got a product that you might not be aware of. No, I would almost guarantee that most people out there are not aware of, and that's why we're taking a yeah. look at it and bringing it to you. Inside this giant case yeah. What's is, in there? is a product of epic proportions that has to do with uh, cooking in the outdoors. You could also cook with it indoors, yeah. but usually you camp outdoors. So this is the Supreme Griddle. Mm. Okay, and when I say Supreme Griddle, mm -hmm. I, I do mean the Supreme Griddle. Supreme is definitely yeah. the right word for What's this in thing. There? So we're gonna open up this case. It's a massive case. Yeah. To unveil the most ridiculous griddle in the world. It's, it's big. Yeah, it is very big. All right, here Look we go. Dog. Now, on Show first inspection, out of this case looks like. Yeah. Now this this thing here. How long should I do this? Probably the rest of the episode. Uh, I changed my mind. I'm not feeling it. Oh. Yeah. Let's, let's just go ahead. And just, let's get the case out of there. Okay. So, as you can see, this is a cooking, I don't know if you want to call it system, because you need a heating element with it, mm -hmm. but you, you know do. what I'm saying? This is a piece of, of cooking, what's the word I'm looking for? It's a cooking surface. Cooking surface, there we go, thank you, for the outdoors. And yeah. I mean, this is just so super nice and super versatile. You may not realize it on first seeing it, but that's why we're here to tell you about it, all the stuff that this thing can do. Yeah. And you're thinking, well, why do I need something that big? Okay, a lot of times yeah. you might be going out camping with just one or two people and you're backpacking. Okay, mm -hmm. this is not this is not the product for that. You can't fit this in your backpack. No, no, but this is absolutely <laughs> definitely perfect for car camping and it's yeah. great for family camping or big party camping or uh, Boy Scout, Cub Scout, Eagle Scout camping. You know what else it's good for? What? Time out. It's true. We're going to get in trouble for that one later, I can tell you that much. But so a little bit about this product. This is from Mr. Carl Lee. He is the designer and owner of Supreme Cooking Systems. Is he Bruce Lee's brother? He is. All right. He is Bruce Lee's brother, Carl, with yeah. a K. Carl with a K. Cool. And he has designed this really great piece of... Uh, a really great cooking surface. I know I keep saying that, but it's actually, I'm just kind of in awe of the thing. So here's the reason why it's good. It's just because you're able, you can cook this over two gas stoves, okay? Oh. One on each side. Show the bottom there, Yeah, they right. have sections where you can kind of yeah. set it down. Or you can use this over an open fire. Yeah. And, you know, set this on the, um, you know, kind of where the grill folds down on a lot of fires. You can set this down on top of it and just cook it. You can cook it over gas, you can cook it over wood, you can cook it over charcoal. So you could have two, like, you know, of your little personal stoves. Yes. Mm -hmm. You know, that people a lot of times take backpacking. So you could have two of those, set yep. them down, and then set this on top of it. Yep. And, that, and then you have a huge cooking surface to work with. Right, exactly. Awesome. And so you could be literally be doing hamburgers, hot dogs. Okay, I've even seen this uh, this recessed portion here. You can pour water in this, mm -hmm. or you can heat up soup. It holds 32 ounces, yeah. this section that's cut out here. You can cook pasta in it. Okay. I mean, you know, you can cook spaghetti. Soup? Yeah. Why would you can't put soup in that? Yeah. It's like it's like a quarter of an inch thick. Because How it's... How are you going to get the soup out of there? You'd use a spoon or a ladle. And eat it out of there. 32 full ounces. Okay. Seems pretty damn shallow to be pouring soup in. I'm just saying it's one of the things they list. I think a better <laughs> a, a better thing for it is is like spaghettis and pastas. They also list soups and marinades. All right. I'm just saying they have it on the list. Pastas. If you see pastas, you're gonna boil pasta in that. Yeah. I'll show you some video from that they have on there. Right. Uh, yeah. I mean it, it, it's it's pretty legit. So you got 360 square inches of cooking area. This is hard anodized, one-piece cast aluminum with a non-stick surface. Very, very easy to clean, actually. Super easy to clean. 
You do want to make sure though that the crack that runs around the circle area, yeah, you kind of get in there and work it back. Because food can get stuck down there and a little bit of grease, yeah. so you really gotta yeah get in the crack and work it. Gotta get in the crack Sometimes and work it. Sometimes you gotta it. use two fingers. But, to yeah, mm -hmm. but you really just need to. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Sometimes you may need a little a utensil to stick in there. So do you ever get lubricant involved? No. Okay. No. Well, grease. There's sometimes there's well, grease. That's what I'm yeah, about. there's grease from the hamburgers that right. can sometimes drip in the crack. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. Some sort of a solution, maybe to tidy things up. Possibly. But basically, you can wipe to clean, and uh, actually, that's the that's the the crack. In, yeah, the All crack. Right. And this crack is actually the grease channel for, you know, any extra yeah. lubrication that drips off your food. Right. Twenty-eight inches by eighteen inches by. 0.625 inches. Mm. This is eight pounds. I can't say enough about this. It's actually really, really cool for large group cooking because of all the stuff you can cook. You can literally cook all your breakfast foods on this in one shot. Mm -hmm. Bacon, toaster strudels, toaster strudels, pancakes, mm -hmm. sausages, mm -hmm. sausages, gourmet cheeses. Yeah. What do you think about that? Like, I, I think five years ago, mm -hmm. you would never go to a a breakfast buffet at like let's say a decent hotel or something sure and see like various meats and cheeses mm -hmm. for breakfast right nowadays you go there and it's like it's a wine tasting for breakfast or something there's all these cheeses and salamis and stuff right i'm just thinking where in the hell are the, is the belgian waffle bar and the omelet guy right i mean those are the two most important people there that that i eat that cheese though but i think it's like Weird kind of. Well, yeah, because they're, it's not, they're not like cheddar, provolone, you know, they have stuff there like, you know, that's been aged for 13 years yeah. from Malaysia or something. It's mm -hmm. like, you know, can I just get some no, regular Malaysian oh. cheese? No, absolutely not. You can get this thing. Uh, Carl has a, uh, I guess, a agreement set up with Sam's Club. That's the only place you can get it. Samsclub.com, $88.18. Kind of a unique price, but nonetheless, worth every penny. This thing is stable, people. I mean, if you needed something to also repel bullets, yeah. I'm not even kidding when I'm saying this would definitely do it. And it is eight pounds. It's very, very sturdy. Right. The case is a little big for it, in my opinion. It'd be nice if the case were a little smaller. I guess, case. Yeah, because the case is huge. But besides that, I mean, it's just a very high quality product. You're going to get a ton of use out mm -hmm. of it and just all the cooking that you can do for it. I mean, I can't think of a more perfect product for Cub Scouts, to be honest. Right. You know, cooking burgers on this thing. Yeah. You know, wiping it down and cooking all your breakfast food on it in the morning. You're mm -hmm. just, you're going to get a ton of use out of it. And the thing is, it's so sturdy, so well made. Once you buy one, it's going to be pretty much it. What's it made of? What's the aluminum? Okay. Hard anodized aluminum. It's one, there you go. And it's one piece too. This is one piece. Very nice. It's kind of nice. I, if I if I took this and I swung it at your head as hard as I could, yeah, it would kill you. I would be in pain. It would be bad, man. It would be so bad. So again, Is this this. Go ahead. I'm wondering, Carl Lee. Mm -hmm. You think the hot Carl is named after him? No. Oh. All right. But I do know Don't that me. the character from A Time to Kill, Carly Haley, yeah. is loosely based on on this Carly. What about uh, what about Carl from that Billy Bob Thornton movie? Yeah, him too. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So um, Supreme Brittle, SamsClub.com, Carl's company is Supreme Cooking Systems. Yeah. So, but this is his main piece. Very, very fine stuff. What's Sam's Club? It's like a uh, place where every single person who is named Sam oh. goes to hang out and congregate with other people. There's a lot of Sams out there. There are. Yeah. And they're also known for selling bulk products. Oh, interesting. Well, I'm, you know, I'm not a Sam, so obviously I wouldn't know. You wouldn't know. But, yeah. but here's the thing that's nice about it. Now, if your name is not Sam, yeah. you can't be on the inside members club. Okay. But you can still buy the bulk products. Oh, really? Yeah. Interesting. So. Hmm. So you can still partake in some of the fun, even I'll though your name, even though your name is Josh. All right. Sam'sClub.com, Supreme Cooking Griddle, really, really fine product. Check it out. Till next time, Josh. Oh wait a minute, he's in timeout. Hold oh on. yeah, it's, he's been in there long enough. My God, he's gonna he can fire us. He's gonna retail later on. All right, there he is. Josh, Gary, I'm Ben. Until next time, CampingGearTV.com. See you later.